What's up guys, today I have got a brand new video for you guys and this is the first video on the main channel this year so I just want to say a happy new year to you guys hope you guys had a good Christmas and a good new year we're gonna kick off the year with a Q&A now I know a lot of people don't do Q&A's anymore but I thought you know what it's, it's a good way to interact with people so I thought do a Q&A answer some of your questions so if you guys are new around here make sure you click that like button click subscribe and the bell next to subscribe so every time I upload a new video you get a notification when it's uploaded and it's not wasting any time let's jump right into the questions so question one what three small YouTubers would you collab with? Now, there are quite a few small YouTubers that like, I'm friends with and aware of. So uh, one of them is Dylan Crawford, because he is the challenge king. He's always doing these mad challenges, like whether it's some eating something hot, whether it's a forfeit of some kind of sort. So I reckon that would be a fun video to do with him, maybe sometime in the future I could go up to him or he can come to me and we can do some sort of forfeit challenge video. Now I reckon that would be really fun. Number two, I would say probably Simmons, if he uploads again, I would love to do something with him because his content would... I enjoy his content. And number three, the Trio Boys, if you don't know, Bedlam Clothing. It's our like company thing, me, Simmons and the Trio Boys and Dylan, he promotes us very well and he's very good at it, very sick. So yeah, those are the three YouTubers I'd love to make videos with. The Trio Boys, they haven't uploaded it in like a little bit but I would love for them to start uploading again because those videos, they always come through with bangers, whether we're waiting a long time for it, but it's worth the wait so I hope they upload again. Bales, Adam, Steve, Get those videos back up and running, boys. I would love to see them. Question two. If you could collab with one person, who would it be and why? Now, there is so many YouTubers that go through my head when I get asked this question and I think, oh God, I, I would just love to collaborate with, with now. If it's like just strictly one person, it would probably have to be KSI because like obviously like everyone, everyone knows KSI, just get the subscribers like that. <laughs> and if, if I can say like one YouTube group, like Simon and Beta Squad, like those two, I would love to do some sort of prank video with Nico. I would love to do something with the Sidemen as well, like the 20 versus 1 or just something like that because I reckon it would be so fun, so sick, so funny. It would be great. Hopefully sometime in the future when I'm a bit bigger and more known by a lot of people, hopefully they see my stuff and they're like, oh yeah, let's clap. So that would be a dream come true, just collabing with any of those people. Who's your favorite YouTuber and why? KSI. Honestly, I have I think he was the first YouTuber that I actually watched. I remember watching his like FIFA funnies. I remember watching like the Get Hyper video and just everything from where he was to now. It's like a big step up and I think it's very inspiring to others. Like he does boxing, music, he's been in the film industry. He does his YouTube, he does his YouTube videos, he does quite a lot of stuff so I reckon that's very inspiring to see it's very inspirational to myself and some of the other generation of youtubers and I reckon it's just good for the community <laughs> who got player of the month ladies and gentlemen player of the month Avarice with Shranilla FC Jamie Stewart come on give him a round of applause for Jamie Stewart boys well done pal <laughs> <laughs> oh god <laughs> oh fucking hell if you had to sleep with two people with the combined age of 30 who are you picking <sighs> I'm not fucking answering that question absolutely fucking not you are wrong for asking that question you absolute fucking dickhead nope not answering that one Joshy and Charlie would like to know if you would embark on another spicy challenge, for example, the hot sauce challenge. And I want to know if you think it's okay for a 10 year old to have his own channel. And if so, what should I do as a parent to make sure it's all safe? 
Uh, question one for the um, the spicy for a spi another spicy challenge. Um, maybe like. I know a lot of people enjoyed my um, one chip challenge. Here's a quick little clip from that. Three, two, one. <laughs> Don't wipe your eyes or nose. Mm. It's getting hot straight away. <laughs> it was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Fuck it out, boys. Ooh. It's Ooh. Ooh. Oh, boys. Boys. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, apple juice. <laughs> oh, my ass is gonna die later on. <laughs> mm. Once I hit another milestone, maybe I will. I'll tell you what, oh uh, god. If this video gets 25 likes, I will do another hot, spicy challenge video for you. Oh god, why have I just said that? Why have I just said that? And for the second question, yes, it is okay for a 10 year old to have his own channel. And what should you do as a parent to make sure it's all safe? Um, well, I think you can like set video. Yeah, you can set videos when you're uploading them to kids only, so it just so it just doesn't go out anywhere else. It's just strictly for kids. Like if there's like when I'm editing my videos, I put not for kids, but you can change settings somewhere when you're uploading videos. So yeah, if if those boys want to make a YouTube channel, then go for it. Absolutely go for it. If they need like a hand. If they want some advice, if they want me to help them, then I'm more than welcome to help them. Uh, Becky, more than welcome to help them. Can you rub your belly and scratch your head at the same time? Right, 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 step back to this one. Right, 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 right. Yep, I think I nailed it. Yeah. Oh no, wait. It's the other way. Oh shit. Is it the other way around? Well, either way, I can do the other way around. Yeah. Yeah. Ah shit. I fucked it up. <laughs> ah well. Yeah. The answer is yes. I can do that. Thank you very much. <laughs> Next question. <clears throat> What's the main goal this year? So this year, 2023. Let's start off YouTube goals. So I don't have any like big massive goals. Like I don't have like a, uh, I have to hit a certain amount of subscribers by the end of the year or whatever. But just my main focus for the year on my YouTube channels is just to like um, edit them a bit more professionally, learn some effects to put in the videos, uh, make the thumbnails a bit more professional, like just to make my channel just to look a bit more professional, a bit more eye-catching for the viewers, and just to, just, you know, just so it's not, like, I don't know what the word is, just to make it a bit more professional, and um, also just to uh, be more consistent on this channel, because last year I was more consistent on my reaction channel, which you should subscribe to, Walk and React, subscribe right here. And um, yeah, so this year I'm going to upload more vlogs, do more videos like this where I'm interacting with you guys. Uh, I'm going to do more music. I'm working on one track, well, two tracks, but I do kind of need to start writing. Like I picked two instrumentals that I want to write to, and I will start writing as soon as I'm like almost done or 
getting close to finishing, you guys will be the first to know. Just check out Twitter for any updates because I update everything on Twitter, whether it's Twitch, whether it's upload schedules, stream schedules, music, or anything like that. Anything you want to know, just follow me on Twitter. Link will be in the description. And yeah, just upload more vlogs, music, more main channel videos this year. I'm going to get back to doing gaming videos, so I reckon that will be fun. Get some of the boys in from, uh, from my area where we can just chat a bunch of shit on card, piss some people off. So I reckon that will be very fun. That's something I want to do. Uh, next question. Best memory of 2022. Um, best memory of 2022. Leaving the Stalin crowd. <laughs> um, I don't have a best one, but probably that is up there. Just leaving my job after five years and then just going to get another one and moving out of my parents' house and just living and living in town and being a bit more independent. So I think that's, it's not really a merry, but it's like best thing that's happened in 2022. Another question. Favorite UK battler, favorite UK battle, Favourite overseas battler? Favourite overseas battle? If you could see any two people battle, who would it be? And also an artist that doesn't battle, who would you like to see give it a go? So this is a question about battle rap. So, favourite UK battler? Sh Shotty Horror. He is just insane. Like, some of the stuff he comes up with, I'm like, like, what? <laughs> like his punchlines, he, he's funny with it, he's quirky with it, he just comes up with some mad shit, I don't know how he does it, but I, he is my favorite. Favorite UK battle? Um, well, it's gonna be a shotty horror one, and he's done so many. Uh, oh God, oh God. I'm gonna have to YouTube a shotty horror battle that I really liked. So I don't have a specific favorite, but Shotty Horror versus Unanimous. That was very funny. I enjoyed that. It's just loads of banter back and forth between those two. Shotty Horror versus Arsenal and the second one, because they battled twice. I enjoyed Shotty Horror versus Hitman Holler. Shotty Horror versus Math Hoffer. And Shotty Horror versus Charlie Clips. Like all those battles, they just have memorable like lines from Shoy, and he just comes up with some of the wildest shit. And so did the other guys. Um, Tony D, I think that's his name. Shoy Horror versus Tony D. Yeah, Shoy Horror versus Tony D. That is a great battle. Absolutely great. I, I love that one. That makes me laugh every time. Uh, favorite overseas battler. I would probably have to say Math Hoffer because he's he's funny as well. He's got good punchlines, good jokes when he's battling as well. Like like I said, with the shot, like with the Shoy Horror versus Matt Hoffer, like those two were just going back and forth with jokes all the time, and that was just a very fun, funny uh, battle. Just those two were just going back and forth so many times. It was so great. It was so fun to watch. Uh, what else is there? Favourite overseas battle, Shoy Horror versus Matt Hoffer. If you could see two people battle, who would it be? Um, right. Who would I like to see rap battle? I would say another Shotty Horror and Tony D. That would be interesting. Maybe Shoy Horror versus Arsenal 3. Um, who else? Another Shotty Horror, Matt Hoffer. I know Shotty Horror was meant to battle rap Tay Rock, but I don't think that ever happened for some reason. And he, he battled John John the Don. Uh, who else? Who else? Yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, there's probably some other opponents that I could think of, but yeah, those are the ones that just flew into my head now. Just as I quickly looked on what battles I watched and stuff like that. And last but not least, what artist that doesn't battle rap would you like to see give it a go? I would love to see Chris Webby battle rap because he is a great lyricist and 
if you've listened to his raw thoughts tracks then he speaks about loads of shit i reckon it'd be very funny and very interesting in the battle rap scene so chris webby um mercules that would be a good one um crypt i think he might be okay because he's very uh rippity rappity with his um who else who else hops in he would do good I would like to see Stormzy do like battle rap. I would like to see JME in the battle rap scene. I reckon he'd be funny too. Uh, who else? Who else? Yeah, I think that's about it. Put Tory Lanes in there. Fuck it, Tory Lanes. Tory Lanes, Dax. Because those two are people that you could probably take the piss out of really easily. And I reckon a lot of people would like to see that. So they, those are some other artists I would like to see enter the battle rap scene like don't flop and kotd and all of them battle rappers and stuff like that that would be very interesting to see all right so this wraps it up for today's q a hope you guys enjoyed make sure you guys leave that like click that subscribe button and click that all next to it so obviously you get a notification when i upload a video so uh do me a favor share this video and also comment down below what you want me to do on this channel and also go over to walker reacts subscribe let me know what you want me to react to so yeah it's been good to interact with you guys hope you guys have a wonderful day slash evening and i'll see you guys in the next one until then peace out